time to start being grateful. You came here on this entire manifestation journey in a desperate attempt to manifest your SP and you ended up on an even greater journey of realizing who you are and what you're capable of. All you need to do is relax, continue to grow and to heal yourself. And it is only a matter of time before everything you want, everything you desire starts propelling towards you and into your life. Your desires have no choice but to come propelling towards you. Before we go any further, welcome back to another video on my channel. You guys, I hope you are all getting your manifestations. If you are not getting your manifestations, you have some explaining to do to me down below in the comments. <laughs> no, but honestly, leave me a comment and let's figure this out. If you are new here, my name is Erin and I am a manifestation coach and I am here to help you get everything you desire, live your wildest dreams through all things law of assumption. So the more aware you are of yourself as source, as the operant power, as the creator, the more connected you are with everything that you want and everything that you desire. Source is whole. It is complete. Source does not lack. In fact, lack does not exist. It literally doesn't even make sense to exist having lack in something that is complete fulfillment, something not existing in a world where creation is finished makes no sense. Lack makes no sense. All you want and all you desire is already yours. So the more that you realize that and understand it and think aligning with that thought, the more you are connected with it, connected with what you love, the more you will receive it. When you are connected with what you love, you are happy. You are at peace. You feel peaceful. That is what we are meant to feel. That's what we are meant to experience. That's the state we're meant to reside in. So stop always trying to feel better about yourself and feel better about your circumstances and stop trying to always feel better about this current reality you're experiencing that you do not prefer. It's not about feeling better and changing your reality. It is about choosing a new alternate parallel reality, the parallel identity and the parallel circumstances, the ones that are so similar to what you are currently experiencing, but tweaked in the tiniest way that makes it feel just right. <laughs> it's like the three bears. I'm not mama bear. I'm not papa bear. I am baby bear. I get that porridge and it is just right. When something that we don't want happens and we are listening to that story, we're listening to our intrusive thoughts, we're listening to our reactive feelings, and then we choose to let those negative feelings guide us down that path. We are letting the story tell our story, but this is our story. This is I am's story, the story written by the operant power. Ups and downs are okay, that's life, but get back on track. Tell the story of your ideal self Otherwise, you are just getting stuck in this loop that this 3D manifested world, which is just your past thoughts and feelings, are telling what your future will be. Only the present moment exists. Our past memories are just as real as our future concepts. We measure things in time and see them linearly. So we're letting our linear past control our linear future when all we need to do is change our story in the present moment. And we do that through our techniques, affirmations, scripting, visualizing, subliminals, etc. But remember, like I said, we are not doing these techniques to feel better. We are doing them to remind us who we are, which is why we affirm using I am statements. I am that desire and I am that fulfillment. Even in a biblical sense, I am is your savior. If you feel lack, you are the savior to the lack. You're the solution to that lack. What saves lack? Fulfillment. If I'm hungry, I am sustenance. If I am imprisoned, I am freedom. If I am sad that my SP is not around me anymore, I am in a loving, committed, fulfilling relationship with SP. No matter what you are, you will be fulfilled. 
you are all of it. Some people say that detachment makes a desire feel like preference rather than need. And that is exactly why I say that you don't even need to detach from your desires because it, that doesn't even make any sense. This is why detachment is not even necessary because you're allowed to need things and be fulfilled. You don't have to only prefer an outcome to get it. You are entitled to having your needs met. Whenever I feel like I really need something, I get it. People can manifest in a state of desperation. They do it all the time. Whenever I am in a completely desperate state of needing money, for example, whenever I am freaking out about money, it is instant that I end up receiving it. Even after dwelling in that fear, my needs are met. The manifestation comes. The money comes. Because I am God. And I am God's child. And God always takes care of his children. In other words, because I got myself. I got myself. So, start telling your story only from fulfillment. Not from waiting and wanting and hoping and wishing and changing. Not from wanting your life to be different and wanting this particular thing to change. Tell your story as if you already have it. Because there is no possible way that you can't get it. There is no possible way that you cannot experience what is already yours. Just know that your life is always changing based on the story you are telling of who you are. That is how you'll get your SP back. That is how you will get any desire. By thinking as the person who already has it. By realizing that you are the complete. You are the whole. You are your savior. Stop telling every story from victim mode. And tell your story as your own savior. That is it for this video today. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. I hope this made sense and resonated with each and every one of you in some way. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, leave them down in the comments below. Make sure to subscribe and leave a comment so I can know who's new here. And I will see you guys in a future video. Okay, bye.